This is not gonna be easy, lads. You've gotta fight. Put your neck on the line. There'll be big decisions to make. You must be first to score. Get stuck in every minute. The right decisions will make all the difference. Bet and play now with Betfred. Passionate about rugby league. Keep it fun. Gamble responsibly. Super League is back and it's the 20th anniversary of the league as well. And what better way to preview it than to have a former two-time back-to-back Man of Steel winner in the studio with me, Paul Scullthorpe. Scully, welcome along. We're going to talk about the Man of Steel Award, the Steve Prescott Man of Steel Award now, and your pick for this year. So there are a lot of contenders and I'm sure you're very happy that Steve Prescott is being honoured in this way as well. It's fantastic that the, the Man of Steel, you know, there's, there's, there's nobody describes it more Man of Steel than, than Steve Prescott and it was fantastic that it was it was awarded that in the inaugural Steve Prescott Man of Steel last year. Some some outstanding contenders this year. You know, I've I've made a notes of a, of a couple of guys here. Two from my club at Saints, you know, Luke Walsh was having an outstanding season last year up until that horrific leg injury. And James Roby, you know, he, he never fails to uh, to perform. Daryl Clark, current Man of Steel at, at Warrington, you know, I think being at a big club like Warrington and playing with better players could really enhance his game this year. Uh, Chris Hill, he was unlucky not to, you know, to, to, to make the top three last year. And Todd Carney, new signing from uh, from Australia for the for the Catalan Dragons, he's an outstanding player. You know, I think if he can keep his uh, his discipline and, and concentrate on his, his game on the field, I think him and Catalan could have an outstanding season. OK, Daryl Clark, you mentioned, he really interests me because obviously he was the Man of Steel last year. He's moved to Warrington, obviously a great club, so he should perform once again. He's out there at 20 to 1, though. I know it's difficult to go back to back. You're the only player to do so, so far. Could he do it? 20 to 1 seems a big price. I think it's, I think it's good value, a good value bet. Um, I think Daryl Clark is an outstanding player. You know, it's the way he plays the game. You know, it's all about pace, and and you don't lose that. You know, and that's something that he will take. You know, playing with a, a better pack at Warrington, giving him more space and, and more space from from dummy half to to take the defences on. And I just think, you know, being at a big club could could bring his game on so much more. And you know, say he's a, he's a key player in a in a key position for a, for a big club. So I think Daryl Clark could be a could be an outstanding bet. OK, we mentioned lots of names. Who is your pick to win the Man of Steel award? I'm going to go for it. Being Doing what I said with the, the League Leader Shields in the Grand Final, I think for, for Saints, who are my choice, for them to, to achieve that, I think Luke Walsh has got to be outstanding. And, you know, for what I've seen of him last year up until his injury, I think he was one of the contenders early on last year. And I, he's going to be my pick for this year. OK, Walsh in there at 7-1 to one to win the Steve Prescott Man of Steel Award. Super League 20 gets underway shortly. We'll be all over it here at Betfred. Keep it fun. Gamble responsibly.